In this tutorial, we'll look at how to remove the please match the requested format. All right, so I have a couple of uh, possible solutions for you. So you can try using that input with the following uh, hooks in hooks into these uh, events, right? So we can say on input, we can we can use the set custom validity function here, and also for on invalid and on change, right? So here we're using try catch so that if it throws an error, we don't you know stop the program, right? So you can try running this code and see if that works. If that doesn't work for you, you can also set or remove the title attribute and try it out right so here for example i've added the title here and it says something like wrong input value so this view this could also help now it could also be the source of the problem actually so if this if this is something that you already have included try removing it and see if that makes it better and then the third option here is to use your own custom javascript to hook into that inva invalid um, event and prevent the whole pop-up altogether. So what you can do is you can just select the input and then when that invalid event occurs, you can you, you can call prevent default. That will prevent the whole pop-up from popping up. By the way, if this was helpful, I'd really appreciate it if you could like and subscribe. Also, check out my courses on CSS and JavaScript if you want to take those skills to an advanced level. Because in there, we will build some beautiful real-world projects from scratch so you can see how everything fits together and really master CSS or JavaScript. And I will also release other courses soon like React and Node.js. So if you want to be notified, then make sure you are subscribed to the email newsletter. You can find the link in the description. Thanks for watching and I hope to see you soon.